Every year there are many shark attacks across the world. This is the story of one of those shark attacks. Yeah, so it's summer, so me and some mates decided to hit the road and get down the beach for some... So we grabbed some cold beers and headed down the highway towards our favourite haunt, which is Torquay. Torquay is a small coastal town, it's about an hour and a half drive from Melbourne. So we arrived at the beach and then uh, we knocked back a few more beers and just watched the sets come in and think about what we're going to do for the rest of the day. So We witness as Australian world surfing champion Mick Fanning avoids an attack from a great white shark at a surf competition in South Africa. Fanning's quick proactive approach by fighting off the shark and avoiding a possible attack or worse, a fatality. It was around 4.30 p.m. and uh, I was resting before trying to catch another wave. The quietness was eerie. It's as if everything had just stopped. Yeah, something just seemed not right. So I was laying there on my board thinking I'd just head back in for the day when. What was that? I felt a huge jolt to my side and was pushed from my board. It was then that I knew it was a shark. I was really panicking. No! 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 The shark had grabbed my leg and shook me. The sea was covered in blood, my blood. I was pulled from the water unconscious and I was rushed to hospital immediately. I spent the next 36 days in that hospital. shark attack hot spots around the world. Our victim just happened to be in the wrong place. Ozzy Outlaw is a person that confronted a great white shark and lives to tell his story. So that's the story of how I came to only having one leg. I miss that leg greatly. It was my favorite leg and I think about it often. Hope the shark enjoys it. This has been an Aussie Outlaw production in association with Clacker TV. No sharks were harmed in the making of this production, but sadly, seven men lost their lives.